Howie um, was pretty bullied in high school. He had a really, really terrible high school experience, but he's since done some traveling with the Peace Corps, went to Argentina, started his own business, and now he is a millionaire. Andy is uh, a great character. He is a musician, and he is a guy who doesn't seem to be able to let go of a lot of the things in his past. Stephanie was uh, very large in high school and just didn't feel comfortable. Wendy is the life of the party. She wants everyone to have a good time. She is a girl who in high school was in her prime and was like, this is my moment. Melissa is a terrible public speaker who has been given two glasses of wine and a microphone. She has put this whole event together and it's really important to her and everything sort of happens in a very high stakes way, even really seemingly low stakes situations. Jed is your sort of all American high school football stud, kind of at the top of his game in high school and just having a good time. What's interesting about a high school reunion is that everyone comes back but the same high school dynamics are not immediately in place because you're adults now, so you have to be polite. So the whole night you get to track and find out who these people were in high school and who they are now. What have they been doing the past 10 years and how do they fit into the high school world now that they've left it? And how do we all relate to each other in an adult world without this strange structure of high school. You know, high school is such a crucial time in everyone's life. It's the time when you're merging from being a child to being an adult. So much is happening and even as adults, I feel like we still feel the scars and wounds of high school. That's what's really cool about the show, it asks these questions. It's like, is it so wrong to, you know, admit that things can be weird or bad or were bad. You know, you, you may feel about it one way when you're in it, but 10 years later, revisiting that is, is really interesting. And you know, some people had a terrible time and it's, I think it's good to get both perspectives of the people who had a great time and where they are now and the people who had a horrible time and where they are now. Come see Little Man. Come see Little Man. Just do it. Come see Little Man. It's so great. You might recognize yourself on stage and be like, ooh. Come see Little Man, October 17th through 26th in the McCadden Place Theater, uh, brought to you by the LA New Court Theater. Yeah!